Look up. Birds soar through the sky, their wings spread wide in perfect symmetry. From the tiniest hummingbird to the majestic eagle, nature seems to favor balance in flight. For centuries, humans, too, mirrored this natural design. Our earliest attempts at flight, from Leonardo da Vinci's sketches to the Wright Brothers flyer, embraced symmetry. Why? Symmetry offers inherent stability. It simplifies design and construction. A symmetrical aircraft with its matching wings behaves predictably in the air. This balance was crucial in the early days of aviation. It allowed us to conquer gravity, to take to the skies for the first time. But as we pushed the boundaries of speed, a new challenge emerged. Imagine an airplane approaching the speed of sound. Air molecules, unable to move out of the way fast enough, pile up in front of the wings. This creates a shock wave, a dramatic increase in drag and instability. Symmetrical wings, optimized for lower speeds, struggled to pierce this barrier. Early supersonic jets like the Bell X-1 overcame this challenge with brute force, powerful engines and sleek aerodynamic designs. But these solutions came at a cost. Increased fuel consumption and limited maneuverability hampered their practicality. The quest for a more elegant, more efficient solution led to a radical idea. What if we challenge the very notion of symmetry in flight? What if, instead of fighting the shockwaves, we could find a way to work with them? Enter Robert T. Jones, a brilliant aeronautical engineer at NASA. In the 1950s, Jones, a master of aerodynamics, began to explore unconventional aircraft designs. He challenged the status quo, seeking a way to achieve supersonic flight with greater efficiency. His breakthrough came with a simple yet revolutionary concept, the oblique wing. Imagine a regular airplane wing, then picture it pivoting at its center point, tilting at an angle to the fuselage. This seemingly counterintuitive design held the key to unlocking supersonic flight's true potential. Jones's idea was radical, a departure from everything known about aircraft design, but his calculations and wind tunnel tests revealed a stunning truth. The oblique wing possessed unique aerodynamic properties that could revolutionize high-speed flight. <laughs>